in all material media, electromagnetic waves always slow down with respect to their speed c in the vacuum. The index of refraction n of a transpar transparent material quantifies the amount of this slowing down and it is defined as n equal to c on v n is always greater than 1. The greater n, the slower the electromagnetic waves. In material media, the physical quantities epsilon zero, absolute dielectric constant of the vacuum, and mi zero, absolute magnetic permeability of the vacuum, have to be replaced by epsilon, absolute dielectric constant of the material, and mi absolute magnetic permeability of the material where epsilon is equal to epsilon zero times epsilon r epsilon r is the relative dielectric dielectric constant of the material and mi equal to mi zero times mi r mi r is the relative magnetic permeability of the material according to these rules these rules the speed of light in a transparent medium should be equal to V equal to C divided by square root of epsilon r mi r. Let's calculate the speed of light in water where epsilon relative is equal to 81 and mi relative is equal to 1. We foresee a speed V equal to one ninth of c. The problem is that this theoretical result is not confirmed by the experiments. The experimental speed of light in water is 0.75 c actually. The index of refraction of water is not 9 but only 4 third. The reason why the theoretical calculus fails is that epsilon relative equal to 81 is valid only for a static electric field. On the contrary, the E field in an electromagnetic wave oscillates up to 10 up to 14 Hz in visible light. Thus, it is all but constant. It can be demonstrated that the correct value of ER is about 16 ninth in the case of very rapidly varying electric fields. So that the theoretical speed of light in a transparent medium becomes 0.75 C in good concordance with the experimental measurement.